good day. Welcome to Multinet Design in the continuation of our budget amid filler, mini filler that we are designing in Revit 2024. So continue from where we stopped in the last period. So we were this is the ground floor plan. So we were able to create first floor plan that have all this uh, function in place. So now we are going to go to the upper floor, which is the second floor. So where we are going to but before then let us quickly create this particular grid so that the grid we have a uniform. Yeah, so this is the grid D and then we create the grid E. Good. So now let's move on to the where we are going to create another level. So we know you have the two levels. So we need to create the third level. So we'll go to elevation. So from the elevation select any of the grid since they create similar so go to the height the, the normal height of the whole space and click that so you can click another one again so you see that you have that for roof when you are creating your roof you have it so it is feasible the only thing is that it's hidden so what you need to do is to toggle of this position then you click this and drag it up so here is what you have in this place so what do we need to do you just uh, grid drag them to the higher level so you draw we able to have them in the real sense so what we do now you go back to level four so here you can, can name this level and you call it level three so instead of we having you level four we call it level three delete and put it level three so it's going to automatically yes click on yes so this place on something so this one too you can rename it and call it roof level you name it and call it roof plan or so you fit to go so it's there like that say click yes so this is done and it's stable so the the next thing that you need to do is the is to work on unifying factors of what you want to do on the level three so click on level three and tie your process so what you need to do here is that you click on the lay on level two so that you'll be able to follow the traces one after the other so we're starting this so here you go to war so your previous lesson on war you start it straight up so you click around that so you set it around the whole boundary so you give that a space so now in the in the design we have we have back in at this point before I forget the whole rectangular space is done so now you do this one in a on the behalf so draw it down let it have that singular now what we want to do here is that this place this whole place is going to be a balcony space so we're going to kick that up out then you do what you do so so you do the same thing here so this place is going to serve as a balcony for what for the the master room so the master room is going to start somewhere close to this point so click here and then you put it in the middle so the master room will have something of this nature so maybe similar with the madam room so the whole thing here is that this master room does not going to have anything do with the with the family lamp so everything is going to be inclusive in something else so here we have it closed down so the bedroom and toilet is going to be stayed at this junction so why we have a reading so there will be reading at this level so click here and then you set it up so this place is going to be for reading so as we have said this is the stair hall at this junction so you click this one and drag it down let it stop here so you click here and create a convenient and comfortable space for that so this one is going to be like a box place so after you you climb you have a boxing box system something here stay here so at the same time we're going to have it that okay someone can sit down and see what is feeling on in the balcony and things like that so that's the concept of this design so the next thing you do here is that you divide this into two 
good so the one aspect of it is going to have a little bit like a if you click here and defy this sorry come to search click on divide so here click it here then you bring this one you pick it here so you express this one in such a way it goes in so you prick this one into two split it then divide it so what you do here is that you add it up to this point good so the space is being done and everything is being accurately unified so what you don't need here is that you click on this and create the floor for it it's uh for this level so you click here and the light from here you put then you stay the whole convenient issue so now that is it so you click this and open the door for good click finish so that what we have at this junction well, we have master we have uh, bad two because it's going to be a bigger bathroom for the master so here we have uh, we have one bathroom that we're going to be here then this place is going to be for reading and a few other development activities that we want to do like uh, so like exercising or things like that so this place is going to be for just the box room and things like that so we want to have in that place so what we do here now is that to click on opening and put those opening in this place so architecture and you say doors so the door from here is going to be here so you have the door again to lead to this place so you get the door in here and you get the door in here so this one is not going to have a half door but it's going to have a longer window that okay that contains door as well and every other thing so this is so you have the, the link from the bed, bedroom to this place indeed so that is what we want to do at this juncture so the next thing we need to work on now is to now bring in all those uh, family templates into place so i'm going to put this one here to be there for now so bring on bed component so check bed so queen size bed just bring it in here so we are still going to change the the bed for the master so you stay tuned and watch everything from the beginning to the end and learn as we are doing this so let me give you a temporary dimension so that you'll be able to work on it as you are doing your design upward so this is the temporary dimension for the putting so if you are joining us for the first time kindly if you need this uh, complete file the, there is one that's already available all what you just need to do is to click on join member and join the second category of the pack we have so you will see there you have access to special design on that level you'll be able to request for whatever you want to request for and go answer you straight up so it's just a little minor payment of dollar then you get the file in place so that's what we have on this is the opportunity that i have said that youtube has given unto us and if you have never joined before kindly click join and become a subscribe member of this one so that you will be able to notify you as you are getting the design on so thanks for watching and everything so now what we do here is that we have already created all these ones so what i'm going to create here is the library setting so these are going to take interior aspect of the whole system but from in this place as I said, I'm going to have a little minor room that's going to be staying here for maybe he as a friend, a special friend that wants to stay with him, that wants to discuss business together. So it's, it's, this is what he said he's going to have. So here is going to be the toilet for the for the same thing. So click here and say bring in. So you have it there sometimes. So this is what you have in that point so here is going to be a library so let us quickly annotate that before we detail everything in consistent training so here we say we call it library okay 
so this one is a master bedroom master room so we have this one is called the box box just call the box prefix so this is the stair and this is what you have on that level so we may decide to do something different maybe even a reason that so that we fit it a contemporary design pattern so for now this is what we have and this is how we are going to work on it from this level so this is the whole region of design so let me go down to level two and let go and transfer this particular so how do we do that so you click on this one and say edit so edit add more level to hit so you select go to south elevation as you have selected that to so select level so i'm going to select level two so this is the level i selected so i will say just connect it and i say apply so go to level two now and see what you have so it's there already so that is in level three so now let us quickly get a temporary uh, section so that you'll be able to see what I do. I didn't create another st uh, steer, I just have to add I uh, attach that one to what we have. So click go to this place and see. So that is the connection we thought I did here. So if you want to see, you follow the whole process and see one more time. That's the way I did. I connected it together. I did not create any of this. So this one is part of the process of design that we we are talking about. So you can edit this one if you want to do them. So if it pleases you you work on something development and you have those things in place so that is what we have at that level level two this is level three so everything is in intact for now so under this one you can just go here and say no so here you don't have anything uh, connection with this again so what we just need to do is to detail this place out and get everything in order before we now proceed to the next level of our design so we are able to do this at this level and next class we are going to work on the detailing of the roof and every other things and